People First Party Chairman James Sung has resigned as advisor to President Tsai Ing-wen. The move came shortly after President Tsai told him to explain himself over a Chinese media report that he supports the one country, two systems framework for Taiwan. The report was carried in China's state-run Xinhua News Agency, which had interviewed Song on a trip to China. Song denies the report, but it's already sparked a sharp backlash. Given that Chairman Song made such a statement, it's my hope that he'll come out and give society an explanation. If he harbors a sense of affirmation toward one country, two systems, we will ask that he leave the post of presidential advisor. Shortly after the president's appeal, Song stepped out to address the report by China's state-run media, the Xinhua News Agency. I never even said those four words, let alone advocate for using the Hong Kong-style one country, two systems as a framework for handling cross-strait relations. According to Song, what he had said to the reporter was, the two sides of the strait are one China. They are equals that are separately ruled. Song said he was offering a solution for maintaining cross-strait peace. He addressed the president's remarks from earlier in the day, striking a truculent tone. Since I'm no longer sent to participate in international conferences, I am very willing to formally return the letter of appointment issued to me by the presidential office. Song said he had accepted a post as presidential advisor so that he could represent Tsai's administration at Asia-Pacific Economic Cooperation Summits. He said that in the face of officials clamoring for him to quit, he may as well withdraw.